What's going on guys? Young Ramsey in this bitch and today we finally have the Smash Brothers update that we've all been waiting for that massive update that brings in Krom, King K. Rool, and Lloyd Irving as me costumes, new stages, new music, a plethora of other content as well too, YouTube uploading, and tournament mode, which is something that a lot of people have been anticipating. We finally have the update live. It is now the 30th, the 31st even. Let's take a look at exactly what in God's name awaits us in this new update, man. Um, now, here's the thing, right? On the official Smash Brothers website, they actually have a section which contains this video. Now, the video itself is apparently just a compilation of all the new stuff that this update has to offer. So, obviously, we have to get balls deep inside of this shit and see exactly what in God's name is going on here. Now, I know a lot of people were saying characters were speculated. Um, there's a chance that these guys could have probably been in the game. I don't know what the facts are per se. We didn't really get a direct. We didn't get a presentation. So right now, the only thing that we have to bet on is our own nutsack. Let's get into this shit right now. Um, oh yeah, I gotta actually mute the music. Oh, wait, I'm sorry, I muted. it. Okay. So let's get into this, man. Okay, let's go. Turn this shit up. So, this is something that looks like it would be in a direct. And they showed this off on the Japanese website. So, the bear suit for the gunner. And then Smash X Metroid. Oh, we have a Samus costume now? Holy shit! This wasn't shown? Yo! And we got the King K. Rule costume, of course. Wait a minute. Oh, wait, oh, I thought that was a... They made him bigger. Holy, and the flying man? Yep, here we go. Let's go, man. But damn, Samus has a costume. It looked damn good. Fire Emblem? Wait, Crom? Okay, of course. You yeah. saw so, that? Very nice. Uh, not the way we wanted you. And we got the Black Knight from Fire Emblem, too. I don't even know who the hell this is, but it looks badass. The Miis are getting way more costumes than we thought they would. And we got Lloyd Irvin from Tales of Symphonia, man. It's very clean. And it's got the music playing and everything. They even gave him the second sword so it could look more like Lloyd. Really awesome update, guys. This shit is so live. Yo! This is just knees, but it's still so exciting to see, yo. Let's go. That's definitely the highlight of this update, along with other balances and character patches and whatnot. That seems like it's it, guys. We didn't get any new characters this time around, but we got a ton of other things as well, too. The Samus costume, which was something that caught all of us off guard, and they seemed like they sprinkled in a couple of other things as well, too, that we didn't even expect. Um, I'm not sure if this is all available to download right now. I think it all is, though. You can go to the um, eShop or the um, on the 3DS, the DLC shop, and buy every single thing that we just saw. Um, let's replay it one more time without audio, just Peggy so we though. can... Um, Peggy Drill. Um, yeah, that's just, you know, so there's a lot of things to take into account here. Not only is this giving us a, a ton of new features and these new costumes, but it's also giving us some balances, some checks to certain characters, and that sounds great as well, too. Now, I know a lot of you dudes have been telling me on Twitter right now that there's a lot of updates being made on characters, and I even made a post about this shit myself. Apparently, Robin has a buff where now she can string together more moves off of the down throw. If that's true... Well, actually, I mean, I already ejaculated a couple of times after hearing the news a few minutes ago, so I'm pretty empty right now, but I still can make plenty of cum after I fucking sleep tonight. This shit is fucking real, yo. This shit is fucking real. The update is out. Did she catch a fucking, bur um, a fucking, um, nerf? Did fucking D Diddy Kong catch a nerf? Probably not. Um, but she, everyone's wondering if they, um, she caught the nerf. Let me see. As you guys can see here, I'm on my, um, Twitter. And I actually made a post where it was like, um, when you hear Robin's down throw, got a buff for more follow-up. I got a close-up of Naira real quick. That's, that's how you do it, right? Am I doing this correctly? Anyways, guys, this has basically been the Smash Brothers, um, what update can you call this? Uh, Me Fighter suit up for Wave 3. Now, the big question here, and one that's somewhat of a controversial question, is this an indication that King K. Rule, Lloyd Irving, and Krom in Smash are not going to happen? Possibly, but... 
keep up hope. It doesn't mean the end of the day, you know? I mean, it, it does not mean the end of the world with this whole thing. Remember, at the end of the day here, I was a huge Ridley supporter, one of the biggest requested characters in Smash Brothers, and it didn't happen, but I maintained hope throughout the entire process. It's never over until it's over. So if you want King K. Rule, don't get discouraged by this whole thing. You want Krom, don't get your balls busted. And if you want a Lloyd Irving, keep your hope alive, man. It's, it can all still happen. We just got to let our voices be heard through that valley, and potentially we can see these guys make a return in the game in October. Nowhere did it say that, you know, they can't have a me costume if they're a character slot. We just have to keep our hope up, you guys. Anyways, let me know what you think about this whole thing. Leave your comments about what changes the update made in the comments below. Um, I'm actually downloading it right now, but the shit is actually complete finally, um, as you can see on my 3DS here. So we're about to get into this shit. I'll talk to you dudes in the next video. Take care of yourselves, and of course, as usual, please have yourself a damn good one.